Hey everybody, it's Erin with Quilting Rebel, and I'm doing a product review today. This is something that I ordered off of Amazon, and I'm super excited about it. So I'm needing something to hold all of my English paper piecing. Um, I've got a really big project, the Queen of Diamonds, and it's just in a box right now, and it's driving me crazy. Like, and I when I feel unorganized, I feel like I can't sew. Like, I feel like I need to have it organized so that I can actually work on the project. I would so. recommend to check this out. The brand is Pack Maxi. And I will share a link with you and it will be an affiliate link. So I do earn a commission if you happen to purchase from that link. So let's go over this really quick. So first of all, it feels really sturdy. Um, it is a little stiff, as you can tell by looking at these kind of crazy handles. But the handles feel nice in the hand. They feel really strong. Yes, they are kind of stiff. Um, but this, does, this felt, feels kind of like a canvas vinyl um material the zippers all feel really heavy duty enough at least um i i don't see any quality issues except for this kind of drives me crazy um but let's take a look um at the rest of the bag so we do have one zippered pocket kind of large on the uh, i'm sorry i keep hitting my microphone don't i um it has one zipper pocket on the outside that's quite large that you could fit quite a bit in now when you open this up we will find tons and tons of pockets. So for instance, on each end, there is one great big zippered pocket on each outside piece on the inside. Then, here, let me show you. There's the other one on the other side. Then you have six pages, six. That means, now these are identical, but that means you have two on each side of each page. So that means four zippered compartments on each page. That's 24 zippered compartments just on the pages. Now these are all the same size and they're not gusseted. They are flat, but I've already tried to kind of fill this once and it does hold quite a bit, a little bit more than you might think. And again, the zippers all feel like they're definitely sturdy enough for this bag so i'm excited about giving that a try now on the back side there is not another outside pocket just on this one side so let me zip this up too so you can kind of see that and i love that it has the uh, two zippers or one zipper two poles excuse me so you can see that this bag can be stuffed quite a bit. It's kind of thick. What is that? Two or three inches probably? Uh, probably two and a half. That's about what it looks like. Anyway, no, that's more than that. I'm so sorry. That's like three to four inches. I'm a quilter. You would think I would know that, right? No, not so good with the math <laughs> right off the top of my head. Um, so anyway, uh, let's fill this up and I'll show you what all it holds because right now, so far, I'm impressed. Okay, I've got her all packed up and ready to go. Sorry, my camera's shaking, there we go. And I don't, I had a lot to go in here and it's not even stuffed halfway. It could probably get much, much more packed in here. So let's show you the inside. Again, I love the double, double zipper pull, pulls, excuse me. And when we open it up, on this side, I have my entire book. Let me pull you down just a little bit on the table. So if we unzip this top one, we can see I have my entire book. That's all of my pattern in here. So that fits in there just fine. And I've got this tiny little cutting mat that I believe I got at Dollar Tree. And what a perfect um, use for this but to just pop it right in here so that I have zero excuses. I can always cut out my pieces. I have that in here. Now, when we get started on the pages, I have some of the tools I don't use as often right here, the ones I use all the time right here, front and center. And then on the very next page, I have put the current block. I just have it cut out and I have the paper pieces separated. So I'm ready to get sewing on that. So what I have done is I have left some of these other pages empty so that when I'm finishing up little pieces here, 
I can just put them in here however I want to. So I left one whole page plus one empty just for that reason. Now we get into my templates and paper pieces. So what I have done is I have put three acrylic temple, uh, templates here and the matching paper piecing here because I ordered it with this particular kit. I ordered the pieces already cut. And then what I did is I just flipped that on this side. Sorry. I just flipped it because if you can see the paper right now, I'm at the beginning of the project. It's a little bit bulky. So I just put the paper on top on this one just to kind of keep so much bulk from being there. So here's the templates, here's the pieces. Same on here, here's the paper, here's the template pieces, they're clear, I know it's kind of hard to see in there, but they are there and we keep going with that. And then I just have some extra things that kind of go along with this project I don't wanna lose. And then I have another empty page that I can put more into. Now here's the really cool part is the way this particular um, block came, or not block, but this um, project came, is they have it separated out into month two, three, four, five, and so on. So I can actually put, I could put four months in here super easy, but I've got two months worth to go in here so that I have zero excuses for not having my stuff to cut out and do. So that is just going to set in here because there's lots of room. And my final one, the bigger pocket over here, I have a couple of great big templates that don't fit in the other pockets and they're paper pieces and I put them in here. So all in all, this holds a ton and it does it neatly. And I love that the zippers work. Super easy. And I'm packed and I'm ready to go. Now, if you decide to buy one, again, it is an affiliate link. So, but, um, uh, I think you're going to like it. So give this a try before you spend the really big bucks on an expensive one and see what you think. And let me know because I want to hear from you.